Yo, what is going on, you guys? Uncle Varts, and we're back here on Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Now, I know you guys have probably seen a lot of these videos already. It's pretty much old news, but I figured that I would still show you guys some gameplay, of course, for those of you guys that have never really seen gold unlocked before in this game. And if you guys have, maybe you guys will just be able to pick up a few tips and tricks here by watching my gameplay here in today's video. We are going to be unlocking gold in this gameplay as well. And then in a separate video, I'll be telling you guys about the tier 2 gold if you guys haven't heard about that already. Well, pretty much there's nothing special about about this gameplay other than the fact that I am unlocking gold for the first time and this gameplay is actually pretty old because by the time you guys are actually watching this video I am way far beyond just having one weapon with measly gold I have several weapons with gold I have unlocked diamond camo as well we're almost close to getting dark matter camo it's pretty insane especially since the game has been out for less than a month at a time when we recorded this video and I'm already so close to getting the mass prestige gonna go rank up to doing that level 1000 as well as also getting dark matter in such a short amount of time for me personally i think like this is probably the fastest i've ever gone and grinded out a game and got really far within the first month i think when world war ii came out i didn't really have any diamond or gold weapons at all and i think i only made it to like prestige one or two within the first month or something i don't even remember but really to think about it it's been only like what maybe two weeks since the game has come out and i'm pretty much at this point when i'm recording about prestige six or something like that that's pretty insane and i already have about three or four weapons weapons in diamond like I, I don't know I'm pretty impressed with myself now when it comes to unlocking your camos like gold diamond dark matter it feels like this Call of Duty for whatever reason is the easiest one to get them done in and the fastest one too now to unlock your gold camo you pretty much have to do a lot of camo challenges and for the most part most weapons will have this set of challenges however there are some exceptions like shotguns and launchers but for the most part all of your weapons in the game have to do with headshots and in total you need to get over 100 headshots and I know you're going to be saying, dude, headshots are so hard to do. And honestly, it feels like they're not, especially if you guys are playing the right game mode and the right game type. For me, I unlock pretty much everything in hardcore domination. Reason obviously being that when you guys play hardcore, everyone pretty much gets shot in the head with one bullet instead of going to play core, where you got to weaken them up a little bit and then try to shoot them for the head. And if you don't really calculate that right, You'll probably have weakened them to the point where you actually end up killing them instead of being able to use your last shot for that headshot. So to start things off, telling you guys exactly what these headshot camos are. The first one's going to be called Hunt. That one's going to be 5 headshots that you need to get. Then the next one's going to be 10 headshots for Patrol, 15 for Panther. Then Monsoon is going to be 20 headshots. Agitator is going to be 30 headshots. Erd is going to be 40 headshots. And then for Bengal, which we all know and love pretty much, is kind of like that orangey red tiger type of camo. It's 50 headshots. And then moving on to Massacre, that one takes a jump into 75 headshots. And then it goes up to red tiger for 100 headshots. And so once you guys get all of that done, you guys get into your technical camos. These are the ones that you have to do very specific things to go and actually unlock these camos. And then you can move into your mastery camos, which will give you guys your gold, your diamond, and of course your dark matter. And so to unlock gold and of course diamond as well, you have to go through your technical camos for the first technical camo it's going to be called roller pink which is actually a camo they're going to be unlocking in this video here and to unlock roller pink what you guys got to do is you have to go and get 10 long shot medals with your weapon this might change from weapon to weapon some are going to be to get bloodthirsty some are going to be to get long shots so it really depends on what it is but here for the icr7 it is to get long shots next is going to be the mother pearl which is to get 50 kills with your weapon without any attachments equipped and for the next camo it's gonna be purple hex which I actually unlock in this gameplay as well it's to get 50 kills with the ICR 7 with an optic and five attachments equipped and then for the next camo it's gonna be called penthouse which is to get two rapid kills five times with both kills coming from the weapon you're using and then for the final camo in technical it's gonna be called spectrum which is to get five kills without dying five times with all kills coming from your weapon and then obviously after you complete all of your camos for performance which is all your headshots and then the technical stuff you will unlock your gold camo for that weapon and then obviously you have to go and get gold for every single weapon in that category assault rifle smgs etc 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 that way you guys can unlock diamond for that whole set now again like i mentioned to you guys honestly the best way in my opinion to unlocking your camos like headshots and whatnot for your weapons is to play hardcore especially hardcore domination but obviously in the gameplay we're not playing hardcore dom we're playing court only because some of the people that we were partied up with didn't really want to play hardcore at the time so i went ahead and played core although when it comes to black ops 4 personally in my opinion i feel like you are supposed to play this game in core it just feels right to play 
played in core. I feel like if you do play it in hardcore on a regular basis, it kind of defeats the purpose of having that 150 HP, being able to see how much HP your opponents have, as well as having armor and whatnot. But down in the comments below though, I'd like to hear from you guys, what level are you guys at right now? What prestige are you guys at right now? Especially since we just had our very first weekend double XP event. So that's pretty insane. I prestiged a lot during that event, but I'd love to hear from you guys down in the comments below, as well as have you guys been grinding out for your gold, your diamond, your dark matter camo? Have you guys already achieved that? Let me know everything down in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you guys. But with that said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's video, remember to drop a like, subscribe if you guys haven't already, turn on that post notification by hitting the bell icon next to the sub button, and also follow me over on Twitter to stay up to date on everything going on. We're going to my videos, my channel, my streams, myself. Thank you guys again for watching. Catch you on the flip side. Arts out.